Oh, that was a Mojave bumper test. What's up guys, it's Eric. I've got the Arma Mojave EXB back out again. This is the new uh, full option roller uh, by Arma. This, this baby is just so much fun to drive. Um, it's just a you know, complete powerhouse over just about any terrain. Uh, the only change I did make is I went ahead and threw on the uh, plus two millimeter from M2C uh, wheel hexes. Um, you know, because even with the plus one millimeter that Arma did, it did help a little bit, uh, but I was still having some issues, you know, with my wheel nuts uh, uh, coming loose on me. So I went ahead and I put these on here, and they do have the option to run two wheel nuts, if you guys can see that. So if you crank this first nut down really good, uh, it's got a little bit more of a serrated uh, a backing on it, so it really bites into the wheel. And then the second nut, I put just a little bit of a blue uh, a thread lock and uh, crank that sucker down too. So she should be ready to go. And uh, Again, I'm running the 1730 Hobby Star in here uh, with a Max 6. So she is a little bit weighted down. Again, I went ahead and threw in a little bit heavier shock fluid in the back because she was just a little bit springy, you know, stock out of the box with the, with the heavy electronics. So uh, we will be, uh, you know, messing around with the suspension a little bit more just to really dial this truck in with M2C uh, as far as the uh, ZRS uh, shock caps, uh, you know, bladderless system to uh, really dial the suspension in on this truck. But anyway, all right, we're going to give her a quick run and uh, see what's up. Her famous barrel roll. Alright guys, I had to throw in a, uh, my 1480 KV uh, 4092 motor Hobby Star because my 1730 finally blew up. <laughs> I've had that motor for over three years and I'm surprised it lasted this long. I did a full bearing replacement on it not too long ago, but, but the rotor finally blew up. So but anyway, I'm going to run it with this. I got a 25 tooth pinion on it because with these smaller diameter tires, we'll just see how the heat goes. But anyway, let's see what's up. That was a Mojave bumper test. Lost control of it for a second, slammed into that bank. Uh, she's still good. Arma tough.
All right, guys, back in the studio. I just want to give you a quick uh, aftermath of the truck after the bash. I've put this truck through several hard bashes already, and uh, she is definitely holding up so far, except for a couple little things I want to go over. Um, I do like to be honest in my videos, uh, for sure, especially with a new item like this. Uh, but first of all, the Mojave, is this is probably Arma's toughest out-of-the-box truck, you know, in my opinion. Uh, you know, without any kind of further upgrades, especially the EXB version, uh, she just definitely, you know, is a definite, definite tank. Uh, you got all this extra uh, bumpers in the front and rear and the sides and this huge body. Uh, and the truck itself is kind of compact, so it really, you know, really protects it from rolls and stacks and stuff like that. Um, it's just a complete land rocket. Uh, it's got killer suspension on her. I mean, tons and tons of uh, travel and the suspension, you know, for rough terrain. Um, <clears throat> but as far as any kind of damages or bends, the body body looks good. It's got <laughs> got some got some uh, scuffing and scratches on it. Got a couple little cracks here and there, but it's it's holding up really good. It's it's pretty rigid. Um, I just put a little bit of Gorilla Tape in here before I ran it, but nothing, no kind of major reinforcements. As far as the inside of the truck goes, uh, everything looks good as far as the bumpers. Uh, drive shafts look, they're not bent at all. Uh, the braces look good. Uh, the chassis, flip her over real quick. Chassis is still, still perfectly straight. Just scratched up a little bit. Uh, the only brakes that I did have on it is the this uh, rear body mount right here is broke off. Uh, despite I put some foam in here, but she took so many hard rolls uh, that that's just kind of called for. But that's a cheap, cheap, easy replacement. The front's still holding up really good. No, no issue there. Um, and this little uh, rear brace support, this plastic piece right here is broke off. Uh, you know, I don't know when that happened, <laughs> but that's, that's another quick fix, but nothing major. It's not, you know, hurting the truck as far as the integrity of it. Um, and the only other thing that I found is you know, that could be a weakness is the drive cups. Uh, or the out drives right here, the EXP out drives. Uh, they got they got pretty chewed up, um, especially this one right here. I'm not sure if I can catch that in the camera, but it's it's chewed up to the point where my drive shaft kept kept spinning off and kept coming out, you know, a couple times. Um, you know, but M2C does uh, did release the EXB out drives and drive cups that are 4140 tool steel. If anything else, if you're looking for a for a you know cool uh, upgrade for this truck, a key upgrade. I would definitely get the uh, out drives, especially if you're running a huge power system like this with that's got loads of torque in it. Uh, that's putting a lot of stress on those out drives right there. And you can just, you know, definitely cannot go wrong with the 4140 tool steel. So other than that, the truck has held up, you know, perfect. The shocks are good. It's, these uh, new EXP standoffs, you know, seem to be doing pretty good. Uh, the towers, towers look straight. It's kind of hard to see them with the body mounts, but nothing that really stands out to me. Everything else on the truck seems to be holding up, so it's a definite beast, and uh, I just can't wait to get it, you know, back out again. So, all right, guys, again, huge shout out to uh, Arma Horizon Hobby for another uh, awesome option in the EXB line. Uh, this this truck is is a great a great opportunity to uh, you know build your own and uh, you know just make it just make it your own. So, all right, guys, until next time, RC Dude 81, peace out.